Hey folks, welcome to a new MA Tips video, this time with a functionality which can help you to add or remove attributes to your presets and get the link to your sequences as well. So the functionality we are talking about is called recast and it can help us in a typical festival situation again. So let's have a look at this simple situation here. I have a sequence which is called color and um, I have three universal color presets for my wash fixtures. What you can see now is that they are working with RGBW, but for whatever reason, I only have these RGB values in there for the presets. So maybe I got the fixtures new and um, I cloned and uh, I didn't get the white attribute. So there can be some situations where I end up with this. Um, you can see when I press through my color sequences here, I have um, the blue, the red um, and the green and there is no there is no white attribute in there. So I want to repair this and I want to get the correct color for my wash fixtures. So what can I do? I select these uh, fixtures and we go, for example, to the color picker. You can see now white is active as well. And I store this in that preset to merge this. The same for my green to get the green as well repaired, merge. And we do the same for the blue, so all with the white attribute. Great, so my presets are correct now. We can see this. Great, everything with the white attribute. But of course, what happens in my sequence is that I still have only RGB values. You can see that, of course, because the link to the new attribute is missing. So now Recast can help us to get this link in our sequence as well and to add the white attribute there um, as well. So what we can do is we could recast a single preset. Therefore, I use the swipes to go into the edit settings and we can see um, a button over there which says recast preset here at the bottom. So we do this and you can see already my color sequence is active with the queue number one, which should be my red. And you can see that now my white attribute is in there as well. So now it is missing for my green and blue preset, but um, I can also use the command line to get this recast command for several presets at once. So what can I say in the command line is recast preset 4.19 through 21, for example, right? So to get the color presets, the three color presets I have here. And now I could also say if uh, sequence six, for example, if I only want to have it for the color sequence. So I can use if to, um, let's say, reduce this command to a specific area. So let's do this. And we can see in the sequence now that I have also in Q2 and Q3 with my blue, I have now the white attribute in there. So this functionality is very powerful to get new attributes to your presets or, and this is the great thing, also remove the attributes from your presets and also remove the link to the sequence again. You can also think of um, having a Gobo preset where you have to add rotation or you created your basic look for your stage in an all preset and you just want to add a color to your existing dimmer and position. And with recast, also these new attributes will be linked directly to your sequence. So check this out, try the recast functionality and I wish you happy programming. See you next time.